The mass airflow sensor, or MAF, is one of the most commonly misdiagnosed components under the hood. Even when the check engine light points to the MAF, it doesn't always mean that the sensor itself has failed. The MAF sensor measures the exact amount of air entering the engine. The ECU then uses that data to manage fueling strategy and emissions. But when the numbers aren't accurate, the entire system suffers. So here's the catch. Mass airflow sensor fault codes can often appear as symptoms of another issue. The DTC doesn't automatically mean that it's a bad sensor. Some of the most common causes include vacuum leaks, high resistance in the voltage supply or signal circuit, a block or dirty air filter, contamination from things like heavily oiled reusable performance air filters, and issues with the exhaust or PCV system. That's why it's critical to inspect the basics first. Check for intake leaks, verify supply and signal voltages, check the filter, make sure that the sensor element isn't dirty or contaminated, then verify scan data. A good rule of thumb is that idle and closed loop mass airflow sensor grams per second readings should be in line with engine size by liter. And then at wide open throttle, grams per second should scale accordingly and make sure to read service information and TSBs. And if replacement is the right call, always choose a premium OE spec sensor. Walker product mass airflow sensors are engineered, programmed, and tested to match exact OE performance to restore proper air fuel balance. Don't just clear the codes, diagnose it right with Walker products.